So for the first time in a long time, I've decided to install my wig on camera. For the first time in a long time, I decided to talk while I'm installing my wig on camera because I normally just do videos with um, music, but I don't know. I just wanted to, I mean, I'm not gonna be like talking, talking, but just like letting y'all know what I'm doing. I am working with clay hair again today. I believe, I believe the last video that I did with their hair was, I think that curly wig that I loved. I love that curly wig. This is 13 by four body wave unit. Uh, let me see how many inches. Is this 24 inches? I don't know. I'll have everything down below, but this is the HD lace as well. Can you guys see? It's HD lace. Why is my camera like having a hard time focusing? I don't know. But I already plucked it. I did dye the hair black because obviously you guys know I just can't do the natural color. And I did do the ball cap method as well. <laughs> how crazy, you look crazy. Um, did the ball cap method. That's all I've been doing with every wig and so I've just been doing the ball cap method. Cause normally I would just like throw on a wig cap, a brown wig cap, a color a day. But I'm like, ever since I started doing the ball cap method, my wigs have just been looking amazing. I don't know what I'm gonna do with this. Y'all know I'm probably gonna cut it. I'm probably gonna cut it. But yeah, I'm just gonna get started with laying it down. I just wanna make sure I want to lay it right. I'm trying to cut some of that by my ear. I think I do. I need to cut some of this off. Oh, I make this so e like the best way to make this part easier on yourself is to cut that off before you put it on your head. So you're not having to cut so much. It makes it so much easier cutting it, cutting that little piece around your ear. Okay. I cannot wait to be done with this hair um this wig and so on because i'm taking a break i'm taking a couple day break from wigs because i just need to have my natural hair out i can't and i also did i say that i bleached the knots i don't know i only had to pluck a little bit like this wig did not need a lot of plucking at all i'm gonna be using my erica j glue are you guys like tired of me using glue like i really just cannot use i really just cannot use like got to be or hairspray for a wig install like when it comes to having to use that i cannot install a wig i don't know how to get it to stick so i'm just a glue kind of girl like you will never catch me using hairspray and if have i done a video using hairspray i don't know oh you know what y'all i almost forgot let me cut these combs out because i cannot with these combs on the inside Literally just take a razor and slice them off. <laughs> All right, I forgot to cut the combs out, so I had to cut those out. I just take like an eyebrow razor and literally just like slice them off. <laughs> and put this back in place. For once, I feel like I got my middle part to like be down the center of my head. Like for once, my part is always like over here, over there. I feel like it's very- I just want to know when a 13 by 4 frontal is going to actually be 13 by 4 again. Like, not the lace end right here on the sides. Like, when is the lace going to go back? <sighs> when will we get that back? Because I'm like so annoyed with that. Like, I want to do side parts, but I just can't fully enjoy a side part if I have to curve my lace up all the way right- I mean, curve my part right here just to make it look okay. So like I was saying before I had to stop, I'm using the Erica J glue. I gotta order me another one. Um, I had to order some more. If you guys don't use her lace, what is this, adhesive remover? Please, I used to scrub my lace glue off with um, alcohol and that was so horrible for my skin, like my skin was dry. And then I started using that, comes off three to five minutes. I don't have to do any scrubbing. I literally just like wash the glue off. Y'all need it if you use glue, her glue. I don't know if it probably would work. I don't know if it'll work with other glue, but if you use her glue and I'm using her hold me down adhesive, the watermelon scented one, that's, it still smells so good. 
and I'm running out, so I have to like shake the bottle. I'm just gonna apply this. Should I just do like one layer since I'm like not even keeping this on for long? Like, should I save my glue and just do one layer? I feel like I should just do two layers just to be for sure because I noticed with one layer my wig would just like pop up sometimes. Maybe I'm being dramatic. I just don't see how some people don't use glue. Like how do you not use lace glue? Like I have to use lace glue. I just can't do, I bought that, I had the got to be gels. Um, the got to be spray, the yellow can, the one in the purple and blue can. Um, I have some hairspray. I don't even know what brand it is. Is this? It's in the silver can. And I just, I just can't do it. Like I need to have lace glue. Like lace glue is all that I know how to do. So I want a lace glue. And I need to put on a wig. I won't be putting on a wig because I'm gonna have to order another one because I can't um, I can't use spray. Time for the second layer. I feel like this is gonna be a really nice wig install because. With the wig just like sitting on my head, it looks good. Like I'm just excited that my part, I feel like my camera is just like crooked. I'm just excited that my part is actually down the middle of my head for once and not off to the side, <laughs> looking like a side part. I think I am gonna cut it though. I just can't keep a wig long for some reason. I'll show y'all what it looks like before I cut it though. I have a bad habit of cutting wigs and not showing what it actually looked like when I got it. Okay. And I don't, I don't normally bring the glue all the way down the sides yet until I like lay it down because I want to see exactly how far I need to bring it down. Cause I, sometimes I bring it down too far and the, um, and the hair gets stuck to the glue that's like hanging out from under the wig. Yeah, I'm gonna have to order some more glue tomorrow. Hopefully it's still in stock. I should probably do it tonight. I'm gonna take a picture tomorrow. Something. I just like gave up on Instagram. Let's lay this down. I don't even know why I took that clip off. Be very careful. Make sure I'm laying it like right on the glue. I'm going to add some more glue because that's kind of. Is that too far forward? No. Wait. Okay. I get nervous with HD lace sometimes because I realize that sometimes whenever I get an HD lace wig, the lace is like always super big on me. Like it ripples whenever I try to lay it down, like it won't lay flat. I don't know what that's about. I'm actually going to that right now with the hair company. Um, they sent me a 13 by six HD lace wig. And I was doing the video for them and like the lace just won't lay flat. So I'm probably gonna have to get it. See, look at that. I think it's doing it. I think it's doing it. Let me just continue, but I don't think it's gonna do it. Well, I hope not. If it does, we'll just figure it out. But I'm gonna keep this going. Let me just finish gluing this down. Oh my God, why won't my glue come out? I definitely need more glue.
Okay, so it's the next day. Um, it's probably it's almost midnight and I'm just now getting time to come back and work on this hair. So let me just show you guys the length. I'm definitely going to cut it. So it's like pretty long. Um, like I said, I had, like I said last night, I don't know the length, but it'll be like it'll be in the description box. But as you can see, the ends are kind of thin and I don't like that on I don't like them on my wigs, so they're a little thin, so definitely gonna be cutting it. Um, I don't know how short I want to cut it, but I want to at least show you guys the length first before I cut it. I'm just gonna cut it. I'm not gonna talk through me cutting it because I really need to focus on cutting it so I can make sure I'm doing it exactly how I want. Okay guys, I'm back. It's been like a day. I think it's been a day and I don't know where I left off at, but I did finish cutting the hair. Um, I have on makeup, so this is like the end of the video. I'm gonna, I'm going to put some more curls back in it because I did fully curl it because I wanted it to have like a body and little like flips or whatever and not just be straight. So I'm gonna go back in and just fix a couple pieces i'm not gonna curl the whole thing like i did the first time the first time was just to get some movement into it so um yeah this video is taking me like three days to do um 
probably four. Well, one day I didn't film anything, so. Let's just put some curls back into this. Oh, did I do that right? Or, if, I don't know, what am I doing? I don't think I'm like really, I'm not curling it, I'm just going through and, well, I don't know. <laughs> I'm really trying to get like a full curl or have every piece be curly. I really need to get another, um, I really need to get another curling iron. Okay guys, so this is the finished look of this hair. Um, I mean, I guess I like it. I feel like I could have, I should have cut it um, a little shorter, like up here, like cut all that off. So that's not doing that weird flip that I hate that shorter hair does. But yeah, it's really cute. I like the layers. I like my little baby hairs. Um, I like it. I, I really do like it. I just feel like I should cut it shorter. I may cut it shorter. Probably gonna keep this wig for like in the future if I ever just wanna like throw on a shorter wig and not have to worry about installing a whole new wig. I'll probably keep this for that, but I really like it. That's be it, you guys. I hope you guys enjoy watching me install, style, cut this hair, everything. I have all the hair details in the description box below so you guys can check them out and purchase some hair. I really do like this hair. This is um from Clay Hair. I don't know if I mentioned that in the beginning, but yes. It's I believe it's pronounced clay. I hate whenever I don't know how to pronounce the hair. But yes, I'm gonna have everything down below for you guys. Check them out. Oh, it's, it's so pretty. Like, I think I did a really great job with this hair. I may go in and cut it shorter, like in the future. If I wear it again, probably take it like up here. It's so pretty. And I love my little face framing layers that I did. So cute. So, yes, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you don't already. I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.